Pretty awesome, right? And you can do tons on this, by the way. There's absolutely no lag. It's completely free and you don't have to download anything on your iPhone. Everything is built into it. And, and we're mirroring an Apple iPhone to an Android Chromecast Google TV. Completely free. And you, and you don't have to download anything on your iPhone because everything is built into it. It's pretty awesome. You can use a camera if you want to. So, oh, that's me. Hello. You can just take a photo. You can see it on the on the TV. So let me just open up the photo. I mean, okay, there you go. I've just opened up the photo. You can zoom in. You can see it on the TV. It's completely free. Pretty, pretty awesome, right? So let's just dive right into it. Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Riz, and today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can screen and mirror any iPhone to your Google Chromecast TV or Google TV or Android TV completely free and you don't have to download anything on your iPhone and it works absolutely awesome. And I know for a fact that Apple iPhones or Apple devices don't go well with Google Android TVs, okay? So I know this, that is exactly why I'm gonna make it extremely simple to screen mirror your iPhone to your Google Chromecast TV. Let's just dive right into it. All right, so there's a couple things we need to do before I actually jump into the video. First one is gonna make sure your iPhone your iPhone is connected to your home Wi-Fi. So it's pretty simple. Just head over to your settings page. Now inside the inside the settings page, go to your Wi-Fi connection and make sure your iPhone is connected to your home Wi-Fi. As you can see, mine is connected and that is pretty much all you have to do. Second up, you have to make sure that you have the screen mirroring option inside your control center. If you're using iOS 17 and above, you can actually customize this. So all you have to do is just hold, hold on it. Again, you can see you can add a control right there at the bottom. Just click on add a control and you can search it. But if you see right there, it's right there. All you have to do is just click on that. You can make it, you can make it bigger. You can make it taller actually. <laughs> and yeah, as you can see, we have the screen ring option. So once you have that in, into your control center, that is pretty much all you have to do. Now let's just dump into the TV and let's do this. All right, so it's pretty simple from this point. So let's just dive right into it. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do on your Android Chromecast TV is to make sure your TV is connected to your home Wi-Fi. So to do that, you can actually have to go into the settings page. As you can see, mine is enabled. Click on network settings and make sure your Wi-Fi is enabled and it is connected to your home Wi-Fi or the Wi-Fi that, you, that you're using on your iPhone as well. So my iPhone and my Android Chromecast TV are both on exact same Wi-Fi connection. That is really important, okay? So once your TV is connected, that is pretty much everything you have to do into these settings. Now, what next up we need to do is download a free app from the App Store. So locate the App Store on your TV. As you can see, mine is right there. All you have to do is enable that. And that is me on the TV, hello. Okay, so once you're into the Play Store, all you have to do is click on search and search something, wait, let me just type in one. Okay, so once you're into the search, type in something called AirPlay. All right, so once you're into the search, type in something called AirPlay. So I'll just type in Air, AirPlay, Play. Okay, so don't worry about it, it's completely free and you don't have to pay for anything as I've promised before. So once you type in AirPlay, you will find something called Air, AirPlay Mirror Demo. Don't worry about it, it's not a demo, it's a complete app, but it's absolutely free. And the, the shout out to creators, whoever made this app, it's absolutely awesome. So go ahead and install this. As you can see, I cannot install it because it's already on my TV. So I have the option to open it, but I don't have the option to uh, install it. I have the option to uninstall it. So what you need to do from this point on, if you don't, if you don't wanna open it right away, you can just go to your home screen. Okay, so once you're into the home screen, you can just scroll. So once you're into the once you're into your home screen, you can see there is an app drawer right at the top. So click on that, or if you if you want the app to your home screen, just click on the add app to the favorite. So oh, there's there's the Air, Apple, there's the AirPlay Mirror demo. So just click on that. As you can see, mine is right there. You can actually rearrange it if you want to, but yeah, I, I find it that's perfect. Once the app is installed and that TV is connected to your home Wi-Fi, all you have to do is just enable the AirPlay. Once you do that, it will automatically load and this is what you see on your TV. As you can see, it's called Beyond TV. I don't know if you can change the settings, but I, I would not recommend it. You can, just, you can just change the settings if you want to. So let me just type in my name. All right, so I'm gonna take, I'm gonna, I'm gonna name my TV Rizzy Super TV, okay? And that is uh, pretty much all you have to do. So let me just click OK, and I've changed the name. Okay, so once you do that, I mean, you really don't have to change anything, honestly. But if you do that, if you want to do that, just go to the, go back into the app again, 
And uh, so once you do that, this is the screen that will, you will be seeing on your Android TV as well. So now what we need to do is to let's just take out the iPhone. Let me show you how it works, okay? So I've got the iPhone and the TV is on the uh, AirPlay mode, okay? So on your iPhone, as I've showed you before, you'll have to do is to go into the control center. Once you're inside the control center, you will find something called screen mirroring. I just showed you before how you can add the screen mirroring. I have that already right there. It's right there. But if you don't want to do that, you can have a bigger one. So as you can see, mine is the right there. All you have to do is just tap on it and we'll automatically show you the TV that is, we just named it. I just renamed it Rizzy Super TV and it's literally, literally right there. All you have to do is just tap on it and will automatically connect your iPhone to your Android Chromecast TV. And as you can see right there, we are connected. Pretty awesome, right? And it's also, by the way, it's absolutely lag free and it's absolutely awesome the way it works. And I've never done this before on the Android TV. I usually do this on the TVs with Air AirPlays or Apple AirPlays, anything like that. And if you can see at the top, it's actually showing you that it's connected to an Apple, Apple TV right there. It's pretty cool. So. It's awesome. It's pretty, it's completely free by the way. It's wireless. You don't see, you don't see any cables or anything like that. You can do tons on this, by the way. You can even use your camera if you want to. So let me just swipe down. Oh, there, there you go. Boy, a sub would be pretty awesome at this point. So be sure to subscribe, okay? So let me just take a photo of this, okay? Oh, wait. Let me just take a photo, okay? I just took a selfie photo right there. <laughs> so I'm just gonna open up. Oh, by the way, you can see it on the, on the TV. So let me just, let me just take it again, okay? So let me just. Uh, take a photo. I just took a photo. I'll just open up the photo. You can see it on the screen as well. You can see right there. You can zoom in if you want to. You can see it. Pretty, pretty awesome. It's pretty awesome. So by the way, a sub would be pretty great at the moment. And there you go. Pretty awesome the way it works. By the way, the audio will be coming from the TV. So let's just say if I want to watch, watch a video or anything like that, the audio will be coming up the, from the TV. So, all right. So just found out a couple of my videos. So the audio will be coming from the TV and you have to make sure the audio the audio is actually maxed out as you can see right there it's maxed out now you can do is just play any video that you like and the audio excuse that and the audio will be coming from the seat right there pretty pretty awesome right and it's completely free so let me know in the comment section below if you need any help I'll definitely help you out and uh, I'm Riz and I'll catch you next one. So the way you disconnect, by the way, is really simple as well. If you have the dynamic island, as you can see, I have that right now. So just tap on it. You can actually stop the screen mirroring right there. But if you don't, if you don't want that, you can actually just go into the control center. You can go into the screen mirroring again, tap on it and just click on stop mirroring right there. And we're stopped mirroring. That's, that's pretty much it. Pretty awesome, right? Well, I'm Riz and I'll catch you in the next one. That's just pretty awesome. Well, that's pretty much it for the video. By the way, if you find this video helpful, be sure to subscribe to the channel, okay? That's gonna help the channel a lot. And if you have any questions, comment down below. I'll reply to almost every single comment that I see. So comment down below if you have any questions. I'm Riz and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.